Okay, now we're going to buy a chicken sun ticket. Okay, so this one, it's available in English. Welcome. English, Chinese, Chinese. Okay. Yes. No, that's okay. It's English. Okay. And non reserved seat. Non reserved seat. And then for free seating on Shinkansen. Uh, this one. Yamagata from Omiya. Yes, for sure from Omiya Station. Yamagata Shinkansen, we were the get of it. Oishida. Today. Today. And two adults. I see her place on the next section for the third Outbound ticket. Outbound ticket only. So is everything okay mm. from Union Station to Oishida Station? And today, a uh, number of passengers, two adults, no children, so it's okay everything. Confirm. Uh -huh. Then that's where you could insert the bills. So, yeah. Mm. So that's 22,420 yen, so you'll insert. Uh, 30,000 yen. Okay. Okay. The ticket from the running Yeah, uh, it says uh, Midori no Madoguchi. So, uh, most of the staff at the Shinkansen ticketing booths, uh, they speak English. So you could also buy uh, from the Shinkansen ticketing booths, or the Midori no Madoguchi. By the way, uh, the Midori class, or the green class, or the green cars, they're the more expensive or like first class cars we're just going to take the regular shinkansen car or we're going to ride on the regular shinkansen car and away we're on the way to the shinkansen uh, platform i have to insert the ticket okay okay Okay, Loki. Okay. Please do not lose the ticket. Yeah. You need it again when you get out of the station. Yeah, and when you insert the ticket into the turnstile, there's like an arrow, okay? So don't insert it upside down. Yeah, you have to follow the arrow. And you, you can see, like, it says Shinkansen, right? So a lot of people are like going to ski resorts and like some people they have their uh, snowboards people following the arrow. Okay, so this is the way to the Shinkansen platforms. You see a lot of people they have like their snowboards with them. Okay. Then we have to insert these again. Yeah, don't forget to keep these, okay? So now, we're going to Yamagata. Ito, ah, 7.34. We're going to take the 7.34 Shinkansen Yamabiko Tsubasa. 1, 2, 3. Okay, platform number 17. So, uh... Shinkansen uh, platforms are just before the Shinkansen platforms. You could see like uh, small, yeah, small shops, uh, Beck's Coffee. Sometimes there's a Starbucks. Sometimes yeah. Tokyo Station, yeah, and also uh, Nagoya Station, right? And there's of course a waiting room, like uh, like this one over here. 
You can see there's like a lot of snowboards. There's like uh, vending machines, uh, convenience stores, another waiting room. You could have your picture taken, I guess. You put your head through one of these. This is what the waiting room looks like. They have like a diaper, changing room, TV, and you can check the schedule of the Shinkansen trains, some tables, and yeah, a small coffee shop. Uh, see you later at the platform. Almost 7.34. So, we have to be at the platform 17. Because, uh, we bought the unreserved seats. We have to be there early. And usually the unreserved cars are like from cars one, two, and three. I guess so. Yeah, two Shinkansen's joined together. That means car number 12. So we're at platform 17. The space for car number 12. We're walking to the place where platform uh, where the car number three is one two three so at the platform there's like some like small convenience stores most of them are not yet open because it's just before 7 30 a.m. now Okay, now there are a lot of signs like uh, this scattered all over the place. So be very careful when you're near the Shinkansen. So yeah, again another small waiting area over here, but this waiting area it's not heated. So yeah, it's cold, it's a bit freezing out here. So now it's 7.27 a.m. Our train is the 7.34 train. So it says there Yamabiko. is there one 17 cars and a while ago it said like cars numbers uh, one to four Jiuseki or non-reserved okay so since it's almost almost uh, the boarding time so people who board the train they usually sh they should board here for this one and then oh here comes the train oh that's another train but yeah yeah it's a double decker yeah it's a double decker Oh yeah, it's the one going to Niigata. So those uh, snowboarders we saw a while ago, yeah, they will be taking this train. So like I was saying a while ago, if you want to get on the train, 
the next train, I mean, the next train is your, your train that you should get on to. You should fall in line along this sign. If your train is the next one, you should fall in line on this one. Okay, I, I think this is our train. Oh, okay. Oh, this is our train, yeah. On reserve, okay, Yamabiko, number three. Okay, so the Shinkansen, is, well, inside the Shinkansen, it's, it's like a, it's like an airplane. So yeah, they have like these tray tables. And yeah, the, seat, the seats recline back just like an airplane. The seats are very similar to airplane seats, actually. Uh, there's like this one for your coat, and some Shinkansen. They have like power outlets. Unfortunately, this one doesn't. I think. Okay, apparently we got on the wrong car. So there's like another uh, set of non reserve cars. Cars number 16 and 17. So from car number four, we're now at number seven. Because uh, if you've noticed a while ago, this Shinkansen is actually two Shinkansens connected together and they will separate later when we reach, uh, I guess, Utsunomiya. So we're going to like the very end of this train to go to the other train. Okay, we're on the correct train. We have to move to car number 16 Car number 13 Car number 15 Cars uh, 16 to 17 are the unreserved cars going to yeah, uh, Oishida again bathrooms okay this is car number 16 oh, I think this is car number 16 this is good enough right? Where do we sit? Here? Here? Sit here? 
non reserve. Okay. Okie dokie. Okay, uh, so we're just settling in to the correct train and correct car. Okay, so like I was saying, this Shinkansen train looks newer than the one connected at the back so and then like I previously said uh, Shinkansen looks like a, an airplane on the inside so they have these uh, uh, brochures uh, guides where the bathrooms are This particular Shinkansen has a power outlet uh, just over there. Okay. And yeah, over there also that's a power outlet. Okay. So not a lot of people are going to Oishida or Yamagata. Some Shinkansens, they have smoking areas. This one doesn't have one. This Shinkansen really looks newer and nicer than the previous one. Windows are bigger. Tsubasa, okay. So the Yamabiko, Yamabiko is uh, the older one. Okay. Right now we just passed by Fukushima Station. So yeah, around here there's like a lot of farmland. and it's traveling slower than normal, I guess. Oh, very big snow. Yeah. It's like more than like a, meet, a meter, one meter thick on top of those roofs. Okay, we're still like more than an hour to Oishida. So we're near Oishida Station. Well, I think this is Oishida Station. People are like shoveling off the snow. Okay, so yeah, this is Oishida Station. And we need to find the bus stop. Oh, exit is over there. That much snow. That's like what? One and a half meters, I guess? Okay. See? 
people shoveling off the snow. Okay, we have to find a bus stop. Hi, Arctic Samas. Okay, bus stop. Station bus. Maybe over here? Bus stop. It says here, bus stop. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, 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 yeah. But. Yeah, better we ask someone inside. Okay, we just asked the information counter, so basically I arrived here like 10.40 a.m. Unfortunately, the next bus going to Ginzan Onsen is, uh, it will leave Oishida Station 12.35 p.m. So we'll just look around Oishida, I guess. And it is freezing outside. Uh, just beside the taxi. She said, uh, Tonari no taxi stand. Okay, the convenience store is closed. Really? Why do they call it a convenience store then? But yeah. Wow, that's like a lot of snow. That is a lot of snow. So now we're at a Japanese restaurant. Uh, just like inside Oishida Station because we're waiting for the bus. This looks like a traditional Japanese restaurant. It's very nice. Uh, I, I could sit here. That was very helpful. They have like a menu with pictures. <laughs> okay, so what you have is like uh, tori soba, so chicken soba. Hi, 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 so we have the same, it's tori soba, so chicken, basically chicken soup with noodles. And you have a deep fried squid. Okay, wow, cool, okay. Okay, so this place, 
This is a great restaurant, okay? Reasonably priced. Basically, it's like 1,000 yen for like per person. Great soba. I I guess this is the bus because it says uh, Ginz, uh, Ginzan and then Oishida. So it's like 12:25 now. And yeah. Yep, it sure is cold. Apparently this bus is like doesn't accept the debit cards, the PASMA. Okay, we'll take this the seat for two. Good thing you said that we should like fall in line early. There's already like a long line outside. Okay, so that bus ride that was like 35 minutes. So now we're here at we're at Kinzan Onsen. So from the bus stop, uh, you just walk downhill, and then you could see the town proper, and it really looks beautiful. Okay, I guess uh, it's really worth the trouble. Uh, coming to this place and the view is incredible okay. yeah. oh, okay there's like a small waiting area here there's a small waiting area I guess I assume it's heated a heated waiting area not a foot bath but it's a waiting area and they have like a a small vending machine inside wow this is one of the moving scenes ocean drama yeah 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 the the one you usually watch ocean it's popular in Myanmar. Yeah. Not in Myanmar. It's available in many languages in most of the Asian countries. Uh, not in the Philippines. So there's like foot bath. Yeah, and there's like four rubber duckies. So. That bridge over there, yeah, that's like in the ocean drama. And, yeah. And you could smell the sulfur. You could smell the surf, sulfur. Uh, in Japanese, that's EO. Or, uh, uh, sometimes known as Iwo, that's where you get the word Iwo Jima or Sulfur Island. Rubber duckies. Now, if you look, if you look at this ryokan or traditional Japanese inn, it has that uh, spirited away vibe. Uh, I think the Japanese title is Sento Chihiro. So it's like that film and uh, Spirited Away. And I know that to stay at these uh, ryokans is like crazy expensive. It's like $600 or more per night. Okay. 
and they have to book like a month or two months in advance yeah, it's really dangerous to walk around here because once the snow melts and or mixes with rain you get ice and that ice most of the time that's transparent also known as black ice because of the asphalt <clears throat> okay we have a big tanuki so tanuki that's raccoon dog in English and as per Japanese myth uh, they have this ability to transform I guess or to be seen as another creature okay so obviously uh, Ginzan Ginzan by the way means uh, Silver Mountain so Ginzan Onsen is a tourist town and they have these uh, unique machines that uh, help clear the snow this one whoa it's quite slippery so this one has caterpillar tracks okay wow okay I almost slipped and uh, fell down <laughs> that was close Yep, and yeah, so it has that, uh, this uh, classic Japanese uh, town vibe. Like I was saying, so Ginzan is a tourist town, and some, somehow they also have this uh, firefighting equipment, I guess, to put out fires or to clear the snow. I'm not really sure but it looks new like maybe less than five years old and if you look at these hotels yeah that's like at least six hundred dollars a night so yeah this town has like that 200 year it's like going back in time 200 years even the motorcycles they have like snow chains Now we're going to tr going to find a coffee shop, or at least try to find one. I'm not sure if they have like a Starbucks here. I guess it really, yeah. Uh, so, honey, over here just slipped a while ago, so it's really dangerous, and we're like wearing. The proper shoes for this one, the Merrells. Actually, it's only snow, no problem. We can just walk very well using this shoe. Yeah. It's because of the rain and ice. Yeah, it's because of the ice. And like I said, because the ice is basically uh, transparent or it's black ice, so you really can't see what you're stepping on. So, yeah, they built up those barriers over there to prevent the snow from, I guess, going down all at once. I assume there are other barriers up there. So, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, 
after having a cup of coffee. Going back to the bus stop. So this is the information office. You can ask about bus schedules and places to stay, I guess. Hello. Yeah, go really going to an Inaka or uh, the countryside. Uh, it's uh, going to an information center is like uh, one thing you should do. Okay. Okay. Anyway, I guess this is our uh, well, the end for like this video, the Ginza Nonsa video. Uh, please uh, like and subscribe and uh, our next video will be about the Zhao snow monsters. Thank you for watching.